What's going on YouTube? It's J Mo coming back at you with another video from Shoddy Mo Show Pools. Now today we're doing a video of the 2020 NFL Draft. We're doing a little competition between the Panini Prism and the Leaf Draft Football. Um, both retail for $21, $22 uh, roughly uh, at Walmart and Target respectively. Um, I did pick up a cello pack at Walmart of the Prism and I picked up my favorite cards of the Kyler Murray in the pack. And of course your base rookie Tua, one of the high picks there, hopefully going number two as far as the quarterback goes. He might, you know, fall number 10, number 12, who knows where he ends up, but that's going to be interesting to see who takes a chance on him with that new hip injury. Um, so in this Prism box, we get six packs per box, five cards per pack. So that gets you about 30 cards. Um, looks like uh, should be some nice hits. Let's see here. I'm not going to read all that little stuff there, but there you go right there. We're looking for the autograph. Uh, delivers today the hottest stars with all-time treats. So you got that. Plus look for the retail exclusive parallels numbered to 125 or less. So I don't know if it's like the pink type or just a different color parallel that's number to 125, but we'll have to see if we get lucky with any of those hits. Um, I have seen a couple of these videos and people get lucky with some autographs as well. So man, it'd be nice to get a two autograph or a Chase Young autograph. I'm looking for a Chase Young, guys. Um, I'm a Redskins fan, so I'm looking to see the Redskins uh, get that number two pick and, and ride that defense hard. Let's do it. Anyways, so that is there. Now, with the Leaf Draft, not as nice premium card, but you get 20 cards per, nope, 20 packs per box, five cards per pack. So, looking at quite a few more in there. You're looking at almost 100 cards. And then you get two autographs per box. So, if you were to get an auto autograph of any of the three top picks, any of those three top names, or any of your favorite players, this might be the box to actually try to get that in. Anyways... I say we start off with the Leaf because it's not the premium card that most people are looking for usually. Um, but we do get the two autographs. Um, it does say autograph cards packed individually inside. So we'll be able to hold those to the last and at least go through the base cards and see what kind of stuff we get here. All right. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right. Now I have seen these kind of flying off the shelves pretty fast. There was only three of these when I picked them up. So, okay. Oh, well that's interesting. It's already in a top loader it looks like. I didn't expect that. So we'll just start like this. All right, let's see what we got going on. Okay guys, so we got T. Higgins, Jalen Hurts, All-American Draft, Cole McDonald, <laughs> got a black and white flashback Emmett for all you Cowboys, and an All-American Jerry Judy, okay. Nothing too special about those cards, but not a bad look to them either. And there we go. We got a base card of Joe Burrow. Nothing fancy, but hey, I'll take that all day. Justin Herbert. They're actually talking about him possibly being the second quarterback to go. Um, if not, it might be Love. So... Everybody's kind of wondering what's going to happen with Mr. Tua there. So this guy might be a name that you guys hear a lot more of. Justin Herbert. Okay, we got a yellow All-American T. Higgins. Let's see here. Uh, okay, not numbered anything. So just a yellow parallel of the All-American. Jacob Eason. Cam Akers. Man, you guys can't even see those cars. Sorry, I'm bumping my thing all over the place. Let's see. I think it's where you can at least kind of see this car in the little guys. Sorry about that. All right. Flashback of Deion Sanders. All right. 
That's a pretty cool card. Devin Duvernay. Clavon Chasen. Justin Jefferson. And then a touchdown Kings. LaVisca Chenault Jr. So I guess those are kind of the inserts there, the touchdown Kings. So nothing too fancy about these cards or the parallels just yet, but hey, I did get a Joe Barrow base. Henry Ruggs is the third. Touchdown Kings. AJ Dillon. Oh gosh, I'm way up there, guys. I'm so sorry. You got to mind my amateurism on this camera work. I'll, I'll get better. So on my second video, bear with me. All right, we got a Joe Reed. A Derek Brown. And an All-American, DeAndre Swift. All right. Another Joe Burrow, Touchdown Kings. Okay. Well, I'm happy with that there. Jacob Eason, All-American. Michael Pittman, Jr., Courtney Davis and Van Jefferson. I'm guessing that the yellow bottom is a parallel with Leaf too, possibly. You guys can fill me in. I'm an amateur when it comes to Leaf right here, so. All right. We got KJ Hamler. It's actually a pretty cool photo right there. That ball kind of falling right in his hands right there in the lap. I like that. Wow, look at this name. Raekwon Davis. Wu-Tang Clan ain't nothing to mess with. I like that right there just because of the name. I'll put him in the middle. <laughs> Terrell Lewis, yellow. Touchdown Kings, Colin Johnson. What is, maybe this tells you a little bit, like, do they have a, like, a, let's see, Johnson from San Jose, California. Racked up 2,600 yards, 13.7, while scoring 15 touchdowns, okay. All right, so maybe that's a name to look out for, Colin Johnson. And then DeAndre Swift. That's the second card I have with DeAndre Swift. All right. Not two cards. It's not, I mean, not too bad so far. Not any big complaints about what I'm saying, although. Oh, look at that flashback of Aaron Rodgers right there. That's interesting. Okay. LaVisca Chenault again. Touchdown Kings. Now that's different because see all the yellow in the background instead? Wow. CD Lamb, is this a different... It's not a... Sh I don't know if it's a short print of some kind or what, but man, he scored 32 touchdowns. Woo! He was moving. Look at that. Back-to-back, -back, All-American. So CD Lamb, Touchdown Kings, and then All-American. Okay. There we go. So we got Jake Fromm, back to back Jake Fromm, I guess gonna do that a lot. Okay, look at this one, a little flashback of John Elway, yellow. Let me get one more in guys, so sorry. Zach Moss, JJ Taylor. Well, I guess my autographs might be in the top loaders already for me, guys. So, I don't know. We got Cole McDonald. T. Higgins, All-American again. And Jacob Eason, yellow. So, a lot of duplicates in the same box. Joshua Kelly. Although, I guess one was a base and, and then a Khalil Tate. All right. Well, I would say that by the look of the cards, Prism definitely looks nicer. That's for sure. Got 
Joe Reed. LeVon Jason again. Yellow Antonio Gandhi Golden. Patrick Taylor Jr. And a flashback of Brett Favre. I guess all the flashbacks will be black and white. I won't mind that. It's pretty cool. All right. About halfway through the packs. I haven't seen anything that's numbered or short printed just yet. Cole Kmet. Touchdown Kings, John Judy. Jordan Love. That's one that they're talking about possibly going high up in the draft. That's a yellow, too, so I'll take that card. Not bad. Jordan Love, back-to-back, All-American. They definitely do a lot of back-to-backs, guys, with the players. Kendrick Rogers. All right. All right, so we're getting some pretty good players in these cars. I don't know the value of, you know, Leaf compared to some of the other brands, guys. Y'all can feel me on that as well, but... Um, I'm definitely recognizing some of these names and kind of happy with that. I'm getting duplicates and different inserts of them as well. So here's another Jordan Love. Let's see if we get a Jordan Love right, right after it. Oh, we don't. I actually get a flashback of Dick Butkus. Now that is a pretty cool picture, guys. That, that gloss on that one looks a little different. It's probably hard to tell with this, you know, poor quality of this camera here on the phone. But um, definitely a pretty cool, pretty cool flashback one there. And then there's another CD land that's a yellow. All right. So I'm getting a lot of dupe. Man, these players end up being some kind of Hall of Famer. I'll tell you what. <laughs> it's the way to go. Jalen Hurts, touchdown Kings. And Isaiah Simmons. All right. I'm just mixing my cards all up now. I don't really have anything that's too big of a hit. Let's see. Let's put it. Let's put the Joe Burrow touchdown kings on top. That's that's what we need to do. Actually, y'all are probably tripping like, man, you ain't sleeve that up yet. Let's sleeve Mr. Burrow up real quick. Okay. Mr. Burrow's all sleeved up and on top. All right. That's the best hit so far. Still looking for that Chase Young, guys. All right. All-American Joe Burrow. All right. Let's see that up. Okay. Another CD Lamb. All right. These must be the... Wow, look at that. A yellow. So in the same pack... A base All-American and then a yellow All-American Joe Burrow. All right. I don't think it's numbered either, but I'll take that parallel all day. All right. Let's leave that sucker up. Wow. So what I'm liking about these cards compared to the Prism guys is these are all college players and rookies. You know, in the Prism pack, you're going to see a lot of veterans in there. You can see some flashbacks and some... Veterans, but these are mostly, you know, rookies coming into the draft. Jonathan Taylor and Austin Mack. All right. Okay. So, got James Morgan. K.J. Hill. Now, there's a yellow flashback of Dick Buckus. All right. So a parallel of that. Got a flashback of Jerry. And Trayvon Diggs. All right. Getting to the nitty-gritty, guys, of the loose packs. Hope you guys are liking this product so far. It's okay. It's not bad. For the price... Oh, I, okay. Let's see. We got Lynn Bowden Jr. Steven Montez. I know y'all are probably killing me like, James, stay centered. Jesus. All right, then we got a yellow Steven Montez. Jerry Judy again. 
And then there's Touchdown Kings of DeAndre Swift. All right. We got James Proach. Justin Jefferson, Touchdown Kings. Must have been had Joe Burrow uh, throwing to him the whole time, huh, guys? Lynn Bowden Jr. Yellow. Jonathan Taylor, All-American. Then uh, Tyler Johnson. J.K. Dobbins. I can't believe out of all these cards, all these duplicates that I've seen, guys, I've not seen a Chase Young or a Tua. What is going on? Eno Benjamin. All right, a yellow touchdown Kings of Justin Jefferson. Jonathan Taylor touchdown Kings. And a Kenneth Murray base. I think there's only one more pack after this and then we'll get the top loaders and see what our autographs are. Okay. There's another Jacob Beeson, that's another duplicate. Antonio Gandy Golden, another duplicate. <laughs> a yellow James Proche. Denzel Mims. And then a flashback of Barry Sanders. That's a pretty cool card. I'll sleeve Barry up. Ooh. Oh no, there's two more packs. CD Lamb touchdown kings, man. John Elway again. Look at all these duplicates in this box, guys. Eno Benjamin Yellow. Jalen Hurts base. Brandon Ayuk. And last pack. Of the leaf. I don't know, guys. Not a lot of big hits. Unless you count these parallels as hits. I don't know. I got a ton of parallels in here, but not sure what to think of this. Michael Pittman, Jr. Terrell Lewis. A yellow J.K. Dobbins, All-American. There's an All-American of Tua. Okay. Finally got Tua there. And then T. Higgins. Why couldn't I get a back-to-back -to -back tour like they've been doing all the other back-to-backs, huh, guys? That'd have been nice. Let's leave two up real quick. No Chase Young in any of those cars. Pretty amazing. Pretty amazing. All right. Now it's time to see what we get in our top loaders. So we'll see what our first one is. Uh, okay, Jared Maiden. And Benito Jones. Let's take this out of here. Okay, so they're just base cards. Nothing special. Not number, not short prints. So base autographs. Okay. So, I have to keep a lookout for these guys. Um, What's interesting is this one... This one almost looks on card. And then this one almost looks sticker. What y'all think? On card. Sticker. Okay. So, there's our leaf product. We're going to take this prism down. We're going to leave the leaf product hits up. And we'll see if prism can match that. And their 30 card lot. All right. So Leaf is okay. I mean, a lot of base cars kind of feel old school, nothing fancy to them. Don't have any nice kind of shine or any prism or any refractor effect. So that was kind of disappointing on all those. But now comes the fun. Here we go.
2020 Prism. We're looking for some autographs. We're looking for some Chase Young. Chase Young autograph would even be double whammy there. All right, so only Okay, without further ado, let's see what we got. I saw Alabama right away, so that's nice. Okay, so, let's see if we can back this up a little bit so we can compare this stuff. Got a base, Dan Marino. Got a base, Kyler Murray. All Americans, Marquise Brown. It's nice. Refractor. There's the prism there. No, not numbered, but that's a nice card nonetheless. All right. And then next we got. Jerry Judy, rookie card. And then Julio Jones. So see what I was saying about the non-rookies? So you got three cards that were veterans. I'd like to see maybe just one veteran per, per pack. But either way, I kind of like that All-American prism there, so not bad. All right, on to the next pack. All right, so we got Darius Slayton. Ezekiel Elliott. Zeke. Uh -oh. We got a crusade. Oh, we got a orange of some kind too. So, okay. So let's let's see what we got here. We got a crusade of Daniel Jones, another veteran. Jeff Akudan. All right, there's a rookie card. Ezekiel Elliott, I'll sleeve eat Zeke up. All right, and what do we get for our orange? Brian Edwards, rookie. That's a nice looking card there, guys. Prism, not numbered, but nice card nonetheless. Yeah, as far as aesthetics, guys, I don't think there's any denying that Prism is taking the cake easily, right? But, golly. Okay, next. So we can see that Chase Young. Come on. Let me get it one time, guys. All Americans. Nicole Hardman Jr. Deontay Johnson. <laughs> Javon Kinlaw, rookie card. Chase Young, there he is. There he is. I wish it would refract it, oh. Look at that, just one off. So the silver is Javon. One card behind it is the red, <laughs> the base. Oh my goodness. Chase, why couldn't you bend the silver for me, baby? Hey, maybe that's a sign of things to come though, guys. Maybe it's a sign of things to come. 
This might be a good little box here. Let's see. Chase Young. Redskins, number two. In the NFL Draft 2020, select Mr. Chase Young. All right. Golly, I wish that would have been the prism. And then last but not least is Marlon Mack. Okay. That's half of the packs down. Still no autograph, but I did get my Chase Young. So now let's see if we can get an autograph of a uh, tour. How about that? Will that be too much to ask for? <laughs> In a retail box? <laughs> All right. We got us a base Russell Wilson. Alvin Kamara. So here we come with the... Okay. There's a blue DeAndre Hopkins. Been in a lot of news recently here. That's a nice card. It's a real nice card, actually. There's our rookie, Nate Stanley. And Gardner Min saw the second. See, look at that, man. We got one rookie. <laughs> in, the, in the 2020 NFL Draft Pack, we got one rookie. Down to two packs. It's definitely, I feel like it's more fun opening the prison, guys, even though there's less cards, just because they're so pretty and you're like, ooh, what do I get here? So that's an interesting card there. All right, so here we go. I got me a John Elway in the prison. Not, not that I don't need any more. I already got him in the dang. There's another Alvin Kamara crusade. And we got a Jared Goff. I want a rookie. Come on. KJ Hamler and then Michael Thomas. And again, just one rookie. The, 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 the silver, that's, that's what should have been the rookie right there. I'm disappointed in that pack. All right, we got one last pack. I haven't seen any special hits. Will I get lucky with any kind of autograph in this last pack? Is it possible? It'd be nice. I don't know if it's gonna happen though. I already got my Chase Young, so I guess I'm gonna be happy with that even though it was just the base. Okay. All right, one last pack. Oh. Okay, so we do have an autograph. We do have an autograph. All right. So we'll start off with rookie silver, Curtis Weaver. All right. There's a nice rookie prison that I'm looking for. Shea Patterson rookie. I just love how everybody on these videos makes these things just slide in so easy and I struggle every time, all the time. I guess it's my fat thumbs, guys. Okay. We got DJ Moore. Lamar Jackson, there we go, guys. Second year. Wish that was a rookie card. That'd be nice, huh? Lamar Jackson. And then behind him is an autograph of some kind. Let's see what we get here. Antoine Brooks Jr. Ooh. And it is a silver prism. Looks like he's a D-back in that stance there, guys. 
I am so sorry about my awful, awful handwork on this camera. So, Antoine Brooks Jr., Silver Prism. Doesn't say much about him other than that. Just has his weight of 215. He's 5'11". I bet you he's a D-back or a safety. All right. So, with that all being said, gentlemen, any ladies out there watching, definitely blows both of those hits out the water. But time will tell as far as where they end up in their career, right? And just a quick recap of the hits. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Lamar Jackson. He's over here laying down. All right, so... Got a silver, Curtis Weaver, KJ Hamler rookie, my Chase Young rookie, Kate Stanley rookie, Javon Kinlaw, silver prism rookie, Marquise Brown prism, all American, Jeff O'Cutton rookie, Shea Patterson rookie, Brian Edwards, Orange Prism. Can't believe that's not numbered. I guess if it was autographed, it would be numbered. And then last but not least, Silver Prism of Antoine Brooks Jr. Not numbered. But an auto in the blaster box nonetheless. There you go, guys. You have Prism versus Leaf. Tell me what you think in the comments.